Welcome to another TCGU video. My name is Bob Jackman. Today we're going to talk about another new feature of Notebook 15. This is the Lesson Activity Builder, and specifically we're going to be looking at the activity of simple sort. What the Lesson Activity Builder is, is it allows a simple, easy to create activities that you can add into your lessons. There are a lot of options for adding varieties to these simple strategies. There's also a lot of room for more of these types of activities to come in the future. The first one that they have right now is called a simple sort. So let me show you how this works. First thing we're going to do is come up to the Lesson Activity Builder on the toolbar. We're going to click on that. That's going to bring up the Lesson Activity Builder. Right now the only activity that we have available is the super sort. And you'll notice that it comes in two different backgrounds or themes. We've got the space theme or the jungle theme. Um, I could preview this activity or I'm just going to add it. So I'm going to go ahead and click add this activity. And it's going to walk me through the process of creating this activity. Very simple. So I can choose whether I want the jungle theme or the space theme. Within each of those I've got a couple of different options. So I'm going to do, let's do Mars. So I'm going to do space and Mars. I'm going to click add this activity. Then, because we're doing a simple sort, we need to choose our category names. And then down here we're going to type or paste up to 10 sorting items. And we can also save and add from lists. So for right now I'm just going to add a bunch in. Now I've got a bunch of words in there. I'm going to go ahead and click Next. Now in this one we can add additional components to our lesson. And there's quite a few different options here. Uh, for example, we can add a spinning wheel to randomly select a student. So we can have a student come up and do that. Uh, let's go ahead and add the spinning wheel. And let's go with a student list. So here again, I can add from a list that I've saved before, or I can just type in the names of my students. So now that I've added a couple of students, I'm going to go ahead and click Finish. And then it adds this very nice looking activity to my page. So you'll notice on the right side where I've got the spinning wheel for the names. When I click on that, it goes ahead and selects a student for me so I could have that student come up. And then they can click and drag using their finger to drag the, the name up to where it goes. If it's accepted, it disappears. If I put it in the wrong place, it bounces back and shakes. Um, if I want to reset this activity, I've got this reset button right here on the top right. Click that, that'll reset it, start it over if we want to do it again. And of course we've got the pencil to go back in and edit that activity if we want to. So that's how to quickly create and add a simple sort activity through the Lesson Activity Builder to one of your lessons. Hope you've enjoyed this.